Well, if you've been keeping up with us here at Channel 2, you know that all month long we've been collecting toys for Tots this holiday season with the Marines. And our very own Rob Fowler is out live at Blackbot on Daniel Island. Joining us now, Rob, you're telling us about this drop-off location, this last-minute push for toys, and how we can get involved. Absolutely, Hannah. This is uh, one of our favorite stops of the year because this is it. This is the creme de la creme. This is BlackBot, and we've got a big number we're going to reveal. The BlackBot employees each and every year give us a ton of toys for tots, and I think you're going to love the number. I don't know the number. I'm just guessing. I just know you're going to know the number, but uh, we're going to talk about that coming up in just a little while. But first, we got to take you out to Nywick earlier today. I had a chance to go out there with the Marines and also the employees. It was kind of bring your child to work day, and they had a lot of food for the kids and pizza and all kinds of things, but they also donated a ton of toys for tots. And here they are, they're bringing those toys outside from inside as they loaded them up onto the uh, the box truck, if you will, heading to the toy factory. And once they got to the toy factory, they were counted and then dispersed to the different age groups and they will go out for Christmas morning. And while we're talking about toys for tots, Sergeant Andrew Duvall was with me uh, here earlier today. And when you walked in the atrium, you saw a lot of cool toys and that's got to warm your heart. It really is. Honestly, that's probably one of the biggest fundraisers where I've seen that many toys all in one place at the same time. So I'll tell you what, uh, the, the community has really come together again this year with Toys for Tots. Uh, you've got a new number and it's really climbed here this week. That's correct. So ever since we've been expressing our concern about a little shortage of uh, toys that we've been able to complete our applications because we've been short on the older kids, Toys have been flooding in from all the drop site locations that we've had, so I want to thank the Low Country for getting those boxes to us. And if you still have boxes, if you could help us out and get the boxes to us to our warehouse or Channel 2 News Station, would help us out tremendously. All right, thank you, Sergeant. All right, John Olson here, BlackBot. I don't know what we say to you guys except thanks, and that's probably not enough because each and every year you guys always come through. Well, Rob, we're honored and privileged to team with you and the U.S. Marines on the Toys for Tot drive every year. This is our 23rd year of participating in this, and over those 23 years, we've donated, or Blackboard employees have donated, 118,000 wow. toys. Wow! So it's uh, it's you know we're all about social good as a company, and this gives us a chance to give back to the community, and give a little Christmas spirit to the Low Country families. Well, I love the setup here. We're going to reveal the number coming up in a few minutes, and I hope you'll hang around for that and maybe help me pull the card off. I am looking forward <laughs> to it, absolutely. All right, so stay tuned. Find out the donation from BlackBot, the number, and I know it's going to be a big number, but we can't say enough thanks to BlackBot. 23 years, 118,000 toys have been donated right here in the local area, and that's a lot of smiles. I know that for sure. All right, let's send it back to Olivia live in the studio at News 2 for a look at the weekend weather forecast. Hey, Liv.